Channel, James and Joanna McConnell 1 Who Serves, OM, Mani, Padme, Hum, OM, Mani, Padme, Hum, Hum, Hum. Greetings to you. One who serves here. Shoshana is here. And we are ready to assist you in whatever way that we can in your questions. You can ask your questions now if you have them. Guest, yes, please. OWS, yes. Guest, okay. I've been noticing that the cranials in my head, especially the low one, what is called the open portion when we're infants, and the left side is more prominent than the right side. So I don't have any concern, but I would like some information. I don't know what to ask here. But I've been noticing it, and it seems to be uncomfortable as well. Thank you. OWS, we would say for you, and we know you do not want to hear this, but you need to ask within yourself on these types of things. It is not for us to share to you on a personal level in this type of setting here. We could on a more personal get-together, as the James and the Joanna are able to bring us and Shoshana through on a personal level for you, this we could do, but it is not for us to do in this type of larger setting here. Just know, thought, that what you are experiencing is something that is necessary at this point in your life here. And we would say for you, though, to go within and ask and you will receive a message about this. It will mean more to you than anything that we can tell you. Now perhaps Shoshana has. Shoshana, Joanna's higher self, channeled by Joanna McConnell, we do not. OWS, she does not, no. Very good. Then we will move on to the next question here if there is one. Guest, yes, I have a question. OWS, yes. Guest, in my meditation, I have had several experiences of being with ancient records. And when I sit in my meditation through my etheric body, I see myself just sitting in this great, great silence. And then I can think about this library and these walls of books appear to be. And as I look at these walls, the first time I was thinking, perhaps this is part of the Akashic record, and then I thought perhaps it is part of the great library at Alexandria, and then, when I got that impression, I saw people sitting at tables looking at books. And then I saw this one person walk up to another being, whom I will address as an Ascended Master. The Ascended Master went through a door at the end of the building and into another pod and drew pages from other books and put it together in a single book and handed it to this young man who had spoken to the Ascended Master. So I have a few questions here. Am I sitting amongst the Akash? And when a person agreed to have an incarnation, is there this guy that is an ascended master that this young person went to, then gathering from the Akashic records from the great library what this person needs to achieve or wishes to achieve, and that is what that incarnation is about. OWS, we will tell you that you are being shown, in a sense remembering here, your connection with the library. Not of Alexandria, but of Portoladuth in Inner Earth, in Agartha. And you have a connection to that inner city there that houses this library. This library, though, is not in a third dimensional level. It is not so much of books, as you are saying, but it is records. Certainly there are records there, crystalline records, and many other types of records. And yes, they are somewhat associated with the Akashic records as well, but much, much less than the entire universal records here which is the Akashic Records. So you have a strong connection to this library. And at a time in the future, as we can see it, you will be associating with it once again. We cannot tell you how or when, but it will come for you. Okay? Shoshana, do you have anything to add here? Shoshana, we can say that we believe that this one has interpreted her meditation correctly. Namaste. OWS very good. Yes. Guest, thank you very much. OWS, would there be other questions here? Guest, I have one. OWS, yes. Guest, I've heard people have received their payment for their rubble, like they were able to cash in some of their currency for humanitarian efforts. Is that correct? OWS, 
we hesitate to assist you with an answer to this question because it is part of the discovery that needs to come forward here. And as we've said many times, we do not want to, nor are we allowed to spoil the surprise for you. But we will say, though, in general this occurrence has not happened yet. It is in process, in part of the transition as you are moving through the various phases that you are moving through at this point. So we will say it shall come, but it is not for the general public as of yet. So no one that you might know at this point has this occurrence yet. Okay? Shoshana, do you have anything to add? Shoshana, we do not have anything to add here. OWS, very good. Any further questions? Nothing further? Then Shoshana, do you have any parting message here? Shoshana, we do not. OWS, very good. Then, we just say, as we reiterate over and over and over again, continue to remain in the moment, moment by moment. Forget the past. The past is already gone. Do not hold on to the memories that tend to hold you down to the third dimensional illusion. And do not only focus on what is coming in the future. Because if you focus on only what is coming in the future, then you do not live for the day. Shanti. Peace be with you. Be the one. Channel, James McConnell.